Hi, I'm Lee Zimmer, and this is the Kids Rock Free Music Lesson Video Series. Today, I'm talking about the chromatic exercise, which I give to all my students, usually in the level one, the first few weeks of level one. And just going to show you how to go through it and what you should be thinking about when you're playing it. It's a technical exercise, not very difficult to think about, but it's very important for building up your technique and your strength in your fingers. What we're going to do is just simply place our first finger on the sixth string at the fifth fret. So we'll be in fifth position. And then we go through, play that note, keep that finger down, place our second finger on the sixth fret on the sixth string, play that note, place our third finger on the seventh fret of the sixth string, play that note, and then our fourth finger goes down on the eighth fret of the sixth string, and we play that. And we repeat on that same string. One finger, second finger, third finger, fourth finger. Now we move to the fifth string, and I just simply move my first finger over, lift up my other fingers, and perform it there. Two, three, four, and again. One, two, three, four. Now I'm going to just continue that on through the fingers, through the strings. Twice on each string. Three, and I'm on the third string now. Second string. Second string now. Just repeat everything that I've been doing. Still going one, two, three, four. Three. Now, if you notice, I'm keeping my fingers nice and curved and using the fingertips to hold down the string. And I'm very close to the fret on each string, too. So I'm getting a nice clean tone. consider is evenness. Now I was doing it like quarter notes, so it's like one, two, three, and I can go faster if I want to, or slower if I want to, or if you want to. <laughs> and you go through the procedure like that. Now sometimes I have students with smaller hands play it at the seventh position, because the frets get smaller as you go up. If you have to go up higher than that, do that. But eventually you want to get down to the fifth position, and eventually you want to do this down to the first position, but that may be, take a little while. So anyway, that's the chromatic exercise, so now you know how to practice it at home. All right, take care.